Today I'm going to talk to you about how to heat your house for free and get paid for it, create paperwork and get the paperwork in and how you can use that to heat your house for free. You may not qualify for an Obama phone. You may not qualify for, you know, food stamps. You may not qualify for unemployment. You may be a working stiff like us and never get anything from the government. But there are things that you can get for free from the U.S. government, which they're required to give you. Okay, here's how you do it. You go on the Internet. You get a copy of a list of all what's called the Freedom of Information Act people that work for the government. And you create a YouTube channel and you create YouTube videos and you make the videos and you make then a FOIA request asking the government, has anyone in your office viewed these videos and ask them, you know, for any information, if they've linked it to someone or sent any information to someone or communicated about your video, you ask them to, you know, to give you information on that. And you tell them you're a member of the news media because you're doing this, you know, for newsworthiness to see how newsworthy it is. And then what happens is the government agent will get your email with your FOIA request asking him to look at your video and of then to find out if anyone else in the government offices have reviewed it. Of course, that's going to spread around their offices because they have nothing else to do but watch videos all day long. And they will then respond to your YouTube uh, video by clicking it on. And if you monetize it, you can make some money. And the more clicks you get, the more money you make. And then they send you a report. And the report ends up like paper and like this, see? And my pappy, what he does with that, he cuts it up. Show him how you cut it up. He cuts well, it up. I just do this. He cuts up those government reports just like that. Proper, proper yeah. position. And then he rips it up. It, there. And he puts it in his bag. And here's his bag full of, full of this, you know, government paperwork. And, and here's another one over there. He's got a big bag of paperwork here. And he's got more in the barn. And then when it comes to wintertime, when you need to heat your house, you've got all this free heat from the government. You can burn it all winter long, keeping yourself warm, keeping the government employees employed, and you can make money on your YouTube videos. Life can't get any better than that when you get something for free from the government and you get paid for it. So now what I want you to do is I want you to FOIA the government and get all the information you can on any stupid subject you can think of, get them to send you the letter of what their findings are and then cut the bitches up for 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 fire starters you don't need to, to do much with it other than that i mean anything the government generates is junk mail anyway so there's how you do it and also just remember put a youtube video up put a link on your FOIA request because they're going to watch it and they may spread it around their office and, and they're then you're busy and they're, oh they got oh they're they got plenty busy. of time to watch those videos all day long so it's better having them watch your video than someone else's video dealing with deer in the landscape deer can do damage to your landscaping trees and shrubs bucks in the fall especially rub small trees and saplings the damage can be mortal to a tree all throughout the season, and especially during the winter when food gets scarce, your deer will browse on the nursery stock that you have. At Highland Hill Farm, we've found that repellents do work for our customers in suburban areas if you have a small yard. The larger your yard, the less likely the repellents are to work, mainly because it's harder to spray everything in a larger area than if you have a small manageable spot. So fencing has become one of the primary means by which people are eradicating deer damage problems to their nursery stock. At Highland Hill Farm, we've been putting up fencing to stop deer from browsing on our trees and shrubs. Along with our fencing program, we also have a hunter access program where we allow deer hunters to come and hunt deer. Our hunter access program is pretty simple. You bring a post and you can hunt for the day. We ask that you bring a 6x6x12 by by foot pressure treated cedar or locust fence post. And then you can hunt for the day. If you get a deer, you get three free days. If you shoot two deer in any part of the season, you get the rest of the season for free. And we give you $25. But for most people, this program 
will not work because a lot of suburban landscapes don't afford owners the opportunity to let people control deer by hunting. So the best method for people is this. Choose and select trees and shrubs that have built-in deer resistance. Spruces have very good deer resistance. Arborvitas such as the green giant and Leland cypresses offer good deer protection, but not perfect. Skip laurels are very good for deer resistance. At Highland Hill Farm, we have a multitude of plants that offer great deer resistance and good deer resistance. So if you have any questions, you can give us a call at 215-651-8329, and we will try and help you select plants for your landscape that offer the best deer resistance that you can get for the problems that you may be facing. So we are located in Fountainville, PA. We ship from our Fountainville, PA location as well as Lenore, North Carolina and Milan, PA. We do ship to most Eastern US states and we do have crews that can deliver and plant for you as well. We specialize in screening and buffering trees. We also raise and sell a wide range of shade trees and shrubs. We are located conveniently on Route 313 in Fountainville for our display yard. So again, give us a call at 215-651-8329 for trees and shrubs. And if you want to hunt, we also have our hunting opportunities. Thank you.